everyone, Ellie here from elliekingfitness.com and I'm here today with another quick workout for you. So today we're going to work our abs. So, we are coming up into a plank position. So, hands directly onto the shoulders, bent back into a plank position. Now you can do this up on your knees or on your toes, so choose your level. So from here, tummy in nice and tight, keeping the back nice and flat, hips lifted. We're going to touch your chest. Come back to center. Touch your chest, back to center. So on your knees, here, touch your chest, back to center. Engage the core. Really focus on keeping everything still. So we're going to do five more. Keep the neck nice and long. Two. And one more. Great job. So coming down onto your back, lying down, pull your tummy in nice and tight, relax the shoulders. So from here, you're going to take a nice deep breath in. As you exhale, you're going to raise one leg. So the knees can come directly over the hip. The shin is going to be parallel to the ceiling and your foot is going to be nice and relaxed. Inhale, and then as you exhale, flip the second leg up. Great, so pull the tummy in nice and tight. From here, Extend one leg, bring it in, extend the other leg, and bring it in. So to make it harder, coming up, we're going to one leg in, one leg out. Keep changing it up, pulling that knee in so you get a little bit of a stretch. We're working the abs. Keep it nice and slow and controlled. The slower you go, the harder it will be. Pause at the bottom. Nice work. Keep those tummy pulled in, shoulders lifted. If this becomes too much, then just drop down back to that first level. Good. So we're going to do five more. Five. Four to go. Good job. We've got three more. That's it. Keep going. Two. And our final one. Brilliant. So just bring both knees in towards the chest, give them a little bit of a hug, ease out that lower back. Great. So coming straight back into our tabletop position, knees are over our hips, shins are parallel to the ceiling, arms are kind of come out wide. So from here, we're going to pull our tummy in, you know, lower both legs towards the ground, and then you're going to come all the way back up again. Slow and controlled, all the way down to the ground, and slowly back up again. So to make it higher, the legs come straight. Extend out, and come back up. Extend out, and come back up. So keep it nice and slow. Find the middle ground if you need to. And don't go all the way if you're struggling. So keep the movement to a movement that you can do and you can start to build on as your flexibility and your strength gets better. So we're going to do four more. Four and coming up. Three. Really focus on using your abs. Two, go. Nice and strong. Pull the belly button into more just five. Keep those abs activated. Good. Final one. Here. Lovely, and the knees into the chest. Okay, so for our final one, we're going to come up to a sitting position. So we're going to balance on our bottom, keep our toes up off the back. So from here, we're going to extend everything out and bring everything in. So really using the abs to keep those legs controlled. up. Pull the tummy into the spine. Use the abs. Nice and strong. We've got five more. Five. Four. Squeeze. Three. Two to go. Last one. Brilliant job. Well, I hope you're starting to feel that through the abs. I'll repeat two more times. 
kind of everything. So, if you like this video, please like it, share it with your friends. If you'd like to subscribe to my YouTube channel for my weekly workouts, then just hit the subscribe button. Also, for more weekly workout tips, head over to anythingfitness.com and join the mailing list. Alright, well, I hope to see you soon. Take care. Bye.